You know, every piece of equipment has the word start on it, you know. If you can't push that button, you're not going anywhere. Tractoring is kind of a lifestyle. Most people wouldn't understand because they don't have a tractor, but once you get a tractor, it's sort of a special thing, you know. Learned a lot of things that are frustrating about tractors. One is that my tractor didn't have a place to put even the simplest of tools. So what we're gonna make is a toolbox that fits right in here. So I can carry a chain, shackles, carry a hammer. Basically like a glove box for your tractor. I've done a fair amount of sheet metal fabrication in my life, so basically I just did a flat layout on some pen and paper. What I did is I just used my sketch and I translated that onto the metal itself. As a fabricator, having three-phase really allows you to sort of up your game. No three-phase, no power, you know. It really does free you up to do things that you wouldn't be able to do otherwise, you know. It allows you to express your creativity, making whatever you want. So yeah, it is, it's quite freeing. When I'm doing a project like this, I really love just hitting a groove, you know, and just bang it out. Develop a really good game plan, just by clicking, you know, next thing, next thing, next thing. So we got basically a little bullet weld on hinge here. Half it will weld onto the lid, half will weld onto the body. Being a fabricator essentially means that you're a jack of all trades relative to metal. One of the funnest parts about fabrication is, is making something and having it go well. Yeah, I think the box is pretty cool. You know, it's a relatively simple thing. Definitely does its job, uh, which is to hold heavy things and keep them close at hand. With a tractor, you always need something, right? You're always out there pulling on something, mowing something, changing an implement or whatever. I put time into these projects here because I like to solve problems for myself, you know. Rather than being frustrated by not having a little toolbox on my tractor 10 years from now, you know, I figure I might as well take care of it. My future self thanks me for that, you know.